Welcome to another edition of GSC Diginet. I'm your host, Jim Caval, and in week four of the 2013 Gulf South Conference football season, we had two league battles featured and two non-conference victories. First, Delta State, now 3-1 overall, 2-0 in conference play, became the first team this season to hit the two-win mark in conference action by outgunning newcomer Florida Tech, who falls to 0-2 in conference play, as Delta State won at home on Saturday, 52-31. DSU overcame a third-quarter comeback by the Panthers, scoring 21 unanswered points over a six-minute stretch in the fourth quarter. Meanwhile, West Georgia, now 3-1 overall, 1-0 in conference play, captured its league opener and moved into its road record of 2-0 thanks to a 31-14 triumph over nearby GSC provisional rival Shorter College. Shorter's now 0-4 overall, and West Georgia trailed heading into the second corner before the Wolves' defense held the Hawks scoreless the rest of the way, and their offense scored 24 unanswered points. Number one nationally ranked and the defending champion Valdosta State Blazers are now 3-0 overall, 1-0 in conference play. And number 14 West Alabama took a break from league action to notch non-conference victories. Both teams won as UWA opened the week by blowing out Concordia of Alabama 71-14 while Valdosta State capped off Saturday's action hosting Game 5. GSC TV Live Game of the Week package and Lone Star Conference foe Angelo State fell as Valdosta ran out to a 20 to nothing halftime lead in route to a 37 to 3 triumph. The win closed the GSC's deficit versus the Lone Star State Conference in the GSC's Lone Star First and Ten Challenge to two and one now in men's soccer. University of West Florida and Alabama Huntsville both picked up two Gulf South wins in conference play this week. UWF earned its way to a tie for the lead in the GSC. And in women's soccer, not much different. Eldosta State University and the University of West Florida battled to a 1-1 tie on Sunday. While VSU now has a secure lead in the Gulf South Conference standings, West Florida is right there with them. West Florida also moving up one spot in the AVCA Volleyball Poll on the strength of a 3-0 week. Lady Argonauts moved up a spot to number 20 in the latest rankings from the American Volleyball Coaches Association. You can catch all of the highlights and latest action from across Gulf South Conference Nation's premier Division II league each week right here on GSC Diginet. Until next time, I'm Jim Cavallon. On behalf of the entire Gulf South Conference, this is GSC Diginet.